There we go. How's it going, everybody? Rookie Prospect Night. Tim with LiveCaseBreak.com. This is 407, the first PYT. It's filled up, ready to rock. There are about 12-ish teams left in the last break of the night. Let me give you guys the link for that. 408, I'm going to up the discount 5%, just like I usually do before we start. And boom. 10% off the last break of the night. Just made active. If there was a team you were looking at, waiting for that extra 5 it's there now. There's the link. 407. Here we go. So much in this. Uh, let's do all the random packs first, and then we'll get into the boxes. But we are going to get all the plastics off first. Nice stack here. Cheap junk is considered basically a donation to us. And what we do with it is we put it in little boxes out front for kids. Five cent, ten cent. I give plenty of it away to kids too, but I don't like to give a lot away. I just feel like it sets a bad precedent. So kind of like teach kids money money management when they come in with like five bucks for their allow you know their allowance for the week. I always try to give them extras, but I think it's good for them to go through the boxes and you know allocate out their money and decide what they want, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So that's the long-winded response as to what happens with all the unwanted base. Anything good goes to your guys' Com C, and of course we rip stuff ourselves too, so we have our own base out there as well. Optic, Chrome, Bowman, and Bowman. Feels like it's been ages since I've opened some 19 Bowman. Alright, there is the break in its entirety. Everything de plasticed. And we'll begin with the packs. Some randos, some new guys that we haven't seen before. We'll start with 15 draft and old favorite. Are we zoom? We're zoom. Super jumbo pack here, 50-50 shot at ink, no guarantees. Here's the paper on the top. The sky blue in the middle, Taylor Ward. Actually looks like we have blue chrome on the bottom, possible blue auto. Our papers and nice Tucker Refractor Ramsey. We're gonna have some points for somebody. Walker Bueller first Bowman Green. That's a nice card for the LA Dodgers. Brolio, that's all you. 61 out of 99. It is looking pretty good again, Crowder. It didn't take long to fill back up. <laughs> Walker Bueller, very nice card. One point for Brolio. Welcome to the leaderboard. And then we have a blue Peter Lambert non-auto out of 150. Two chromes and paper. So no auto in the first 15 draft. Let's see if we get lucky, get one in the second. We should. 50-50 odds here. Okay, Cody Poteet. We got a David Dahl, Julio, and Adamas. Austin Riley Chrome. Naylor Tate. We do have an auto. Good luck. Bo Burrows. We hit him on the first side. Or 406, I guess. Not the first side. Bo Burrows is the very first auto out of this break. Let me just reset the awful music so we have something in the background. Chrome and Chrome. Hmm. We've got one pack of 17 draft in this. Can we get lucky? Got some refractors. Hazley. Compusano and Hurst. Nothing. Kyle Wright, Chang, Trammell, and Laz Armenteros. And paper. Alright. 17 tops chrome jumbo. Sounds good, Kevin. Um, I would say shoot me an email or a message tomorrow, and I'll make sure you're prepped on everything that uh, you know, everything the program offers. So, won't have any surprises. Nice Ben Benintendi. Boy, that's beautiful. Seventeen tops Chrome here. Mancini rookie in there. Edwin and Glass now. 
Nothing for ink, though. Five autos in a chrome jumbo box. About a 40% shot of ink in each pack. Same thing here. 18 chrome. Lindor Refractor. Devers Rookie Throwback. Superstar Noah. No ink. Kevin Pilar and Marwin, on to 15 Chrome Jumbo. Thank you, James. O is Dawn, 408. Got the old Sky Blue Nick Gordon. That is a promo expired for social media, I believe. And we got an auto out of 15 Chrome. My God, it's a Bellinger. <laughs> Holy shit. Braulio, my friend. Unbelievable hit. You had minuscule odds. One pack of 15 Bowman Chrome Jumbo in here. Unbelievable. Amazing hit. I am thrilled for you, buddy. Pretty sure those are around a thousand bucks raw. Are they not? Maybe even more than that. God, that's getting sleeved right away. Hold on. Hold the phone. There's the end of the pack. Alright, that's why we like the random packs. They don't always deliver, but holy crap. Big ones like that. Definitely recommend grading on that Brawlio. Whether you do it yourself or do it with us, just let me know. You can immensely increase the value on that, and that is a really sharp Bellinger. Really, really, really sharp. Centering is great. Top, bottom, left. All solid, right? Maybe a bit of a question, just to touch off. And refer to the back, though. Back centering 50-50. Absolutely perfect. Nice car, dude. Big hit, finally. All right. We are downsizing to one 11 draft pack per box, or per rookie pee break. We only have a few left, and it's gone. 12 draft. Haven't had this one in a long time. Let's see what we got. Yasmany Grandal's rookie card. Kirk Neuenheis. Here's the chrome. We got Martin Perez and Wyatt Matheson. Prospect challenge is very expired. And Marcus Stroman's first Bowman card. Very nice. Very, very nice. Second pack of 2012 draft. Any surprises in here? Devin Messerocco's rookie. Josh Martin, first Bowman, and who's the second Chrome? Joel Lacone, Refractor. Shane Watson and Mitch Hanniger, first Bowman. That's kind of neat. Little M's mojo. And the Joe Lacone was the Refractor. Ofer on the 12 draft. Let's try the 11 draft. Braulio, my man. Congrats, dude. That is such a once-in-a-lifetime pull out of a single pack. Nothing like that. That was sitting on the rookie P shelves for two and a half weeks. Waiting. Justin James, Brigman, and Matthew Budgel, so no trout this week. Well, I should say no trout out of this break. Alright, we got 17 or uh, 16 draft and 18 draft. Auto from each, super jumbo pack of each. Did you have a Bellinger in your collection yet, Braulio? The single pack of 15 Chrome Jumbo in the break, Mike. Bellinger. <laughs> Let me just send a quick picture of that to Larry. Boom, shagalaka. Okay, we're going 16 draft first. Ooh, we got True Blue peeking out on the autograph stack. Hope it's a big one. Damn, we got Blue Wave peeking out over here. I guess this could be the autograph stack, too. Blue Wave and True Blue. Someone's getting blue. Brian Reynolds, first Bowman there. Corbin Burns, the man. Brian Bull, Eric Fetty. The Blue Wave is actually the auto. And it's Ian Anderson, former first-round pick. Sixth overall by the Braves back in 2016, I believe. Or was it fifth? It's actually third overall. 2016 draft. 135 out of 150. Ian Anderson. I can, Braulio. I will pop it right in the next Beckett sub. I'm going out within a few weeks, so it shouldn't be too much long. Or too long. 
Ian Anderson, Blue Wave, very nice card. Atlanta Brave, Shannon. I have not kept up on how Ian Anderson has performed. I'm going to assume not so well since nobody talks about him. All right, so this side had a true blue. There's all paper there. Robert Tyler's a numbered, 499. Here's our chrome, 16 draft. Let's see who the true blue is. Michael Paez, Eric Fetty. All the big names in there, we get Eric Fetty. Kid's got a nice curveball, though. 103 out of 150 on the Fetty. No F Chad, no. Adamas, Cozens, Garrett, and Burns. 18 draft time. Messy break. On this side. All paper here, top and bottom stack. Just for anybody that hasn't seen draft yet, here's the chrome stack. I don't think this is the autograph side, but I could be fooled. Refractors, Merker, Anderson, Shawarwarwarn, and Dylan Cease. That is awesome. Yeah, it's up on eBay, Jaren. Still for sale. Best offer on it so far, I think, was 1500 1600 somewhere in that ballpark. It graded a 9, if you forgot. We could not squeeze the gem out of that one for you. Most of the time, we can. All right. Autograph on the way out of 18 draft. Alec Baum. It's a Blue Jay. It's Griffin Conine. Nice. Graf Dean with the Jays in the first PYT. A little streaky on the Griffin Conine, but a nice card. I do not have one that I have, like, ready to publish, Kevin. Uh, when I do pricing and stuff, I have cheat sheets I pull up, but they're very partial. Like, I just I make sure I, I notate the big names so I don't forget. I don't have full cheat sheets, but it would actually be really easy to make, and I bet Ron and I could figure out something for that. Kalenic, Larnock, Juwan Harris, and Brian Miller. Nice Kalenic there. It's actually something we could probably feature for Rookie P Night. Just keep a clickable link somewhere on the screen in YouTube where you can click it and then see the breakdown. All right, let's get into some optic. All the loose packs are done. These are all sealed boxes from this point on. Rather, were sealed boxes. Ron does love himself some spreadsheets. We got a numbered card in the first stack. Possible hot box. Ah, no numbered card in the second. But there was a refractor that could be ink. No, no hot box. That's okay. Oh, it's very hard, Kevin. Yeah, I mean, look, I I do it for a living, and I forget all the time. If it weren't for spreadsheets, I, I don't know if I'd have any knowledge. They help me retain it. Was there anyone you were specifically looking for, though, Kevin, or were you just making a general statement? So it's not a numbered hotbox. Still could be an autograph hotbox. Okay, this is a box of the brand new 2019 Optic Baseball. Very popular product here. Most of you guys have seen it. 
Most of you guys have joined cases of it with us, so. Let's see what we got. Could be a hot box with five autos. Should have two at minimum. There's one right off the bat. Danny Jansen, rated rookie on the 85 design. For the Toronto Blue Jays, Dean. You got a Griffin Conine and a Danny Jansen. That is the sticker version. The majority of the autos in this are on card. Sticker versions are actually tougher to hit. Juan Moncada, Hollow Diamond King. That's a term for a refractor in Panini, in case anybody's wondering. Loriano Hollow. Noah Syndergaard. We got a Purple Star, Xander Bogarts for Boston. That should be out of 125, and it is. I, it's, it's tough. People don't, like, Megas don't sell anywhere as close to regular Chromes as a rule. But with that legitimately being his first auto, I, I really don't know how the market's going to play out. I wouldn't be surprised if his Bowman Chrome true auto, or true autograph does outsell it. Just because the Megas are, you know, a little, little awkward looking. It shouldn't, yeah, I mean, that would be stupid if they did that. They have done that in the past, so I wouldn't put it past them. Ooh. Oh, damn, that's sharp as hell. That's why we love this stuff. Just the centering is off, but my god, that's a beautiful card. Tatis, blue, rated rookie, SP to 35. Steven K, nice buy with San Diego, buddy. Definite grading candidate if you want to. Centering's off, so I would do PSA if you do anything. And the number is 9 out of 35. Beautiful card. Absolutely beautiful card. Stunner. I'm going to get that sleeved right away. Pink Velo. Nice Eloy rated rookie. Caleb Ferguson. That is out of 199. we got to give some points for that Tatis, too. So 199 on the Ferguson. We'll do the Tatis points in just a second. Mancini, Merrifield, and a beautiful Illusions Acuna. Okay. Didn't have anything before that, right? Nope. Okay, 35, that's the same as a gold, so. Four points for the Padres, Stephen K. Right into the mix, buddy. In the end, we do have some color peeking out here. We got a hollow Kevin Kramer. Sal Perez. And rated rookie, Miles Straw for the Strohs. Vladdy and Scherzer. I think orange is 99. One point card for Houston. Whoever my Houston owner is. 75 out of 99. It's Miles Straw. The Strohs were Jaren. First point of the night for you, Jaren. You got the nice tucker earlier, too. Let's do one of the big ones. 18 Bowman Chrome. This was a sealed hobby box. Here's the two minis. How did I see Jaron with the strokes? What is going on here? What did I look at? Oh, just looked at the wrong line. Steven! My bad, dude. You guys are right next to each other. <laughs> I'm trying to take points away from my fellow Blue Jays brethren. It's awful. Me too, James. All right, 18 chrome, I see purple, I see blue. I mean, two autos, should be one on this side, Miguel and Duhar. The purple is a Kyle Tucker, purple shimmer, super high numbering. Willie Calhoun and Alcantara. Nice Acuna rookie. This stuff's going just a wee bit nuts. Shannon, that's all you. Nice rookie. Bowman Chrome. The blue could have ink. Let's see. It is a non-auto. Chris Torres, 150 for the Marlins. 63 out of 150. Marlins are Murray. Chris Torres. I don't know much about Chris Torres. Auto's hiding in here. And there it is. 
Travis Lakins for the Boston Red Sox. A little fruit fly. Lakins right there. Red Sox, Chad. There's a lot of Tucker tonight, yeah. You're not kidding. JP Crawford and Verdugo on the bottom. Gotta get a sleeve on that Tatis before the fruit fly lands on it. One more look at that. God, that's beautiful. Okay, other side. We're just gonna go pack by pack. I don't wanna risk anything getting scratched here. Fowler and Stevenson. There's the F chat I was waiting for. Taylor Trammell, we got an insert auto. It's Robles for the Washington Nationals. Brian J, nice card, man. I think those are out of 99, should be some points. Arizona Fall League insert for Victor. Oh, no points, 12 out of 150. Nice card though, Brian, very nice card. We got Bellinger, Tatis, and Robles in this break so far. Bellinger and Cespedes. Blue, Ichiro. Boy, that's sharp. If I had better centering, I would try to grade that just for the possibility of black label. Unreal card. Mariners, Brad W. Beautiful card, man. 82 out of 150, Blue Ichi. Josh Bell, Kevin Kermeyer. We already got our auto. There could be a bonus. Trout and Jordan Hicks. Sometimes the insert autos are bonuses, but not always. Nice Shohei Sterling rookie. Sharp looking card there. Soroka, Lorenzo Kane, last pack out of 18 Chrome. Nice Acuna Fall League, Benny and Maley. And that is it. Apply to a quick message. Me too. Save the leaf to the end. Let's roll into Topps Chrome. Twenty nineteen, brand new stuff. You guys know Topps Chrome. Yeah, eighteen Bowman Chrome was a beautiful one. I wish it hadn't exploded when it did. I wish it would last a little longer. We can all thank Jordan Alvarez for that, though. Stacks here, go through them half by half. Anybody looking for a team? We do have one more break. Sister break to this, same exact product breakdown. 408, there's about 10, 11 teams left. If you'd like the link, just ask and I'll drop it in the chat. You can also just find it by going to the website though. I see gold wave. Not true gold, but gold wave. Okay, two autographs will find us here. Kyle Tucker, rookie refractor. Very nice card. The Tucker Knight continues. Jeff McNeil, nice rookie. Devers negative, very sharp card for the Sox. Chad. First rookie auto, Reese McGuire. Blue Jays having an okay break. Three autos now. No Vlad, none of the big boys, but three solid autos. Reese McGuire. Griffin Conine's actually selling pretty well, too. Got a prism parallel here, Brandon Crawford. Ian Desmond, that might be a refractor. Or, it is a refractor, that might be a variation, but I don't think they would give Ian Desmond a variation. Reese McGuire, rookie. Poor 
Purple Freshman Flash Loriano, not purple. That's just what they look like this year. Yes, they really are. Blake Trainin. O'Hearn. Fletcher. Nice Prism rookie, Danny Jansen. Another Prism, Will Myers. Stroman and Suarez. To the other side we go. Remember, there is that gold wave about halfway through. I'm going to put it on the bottom. Right there. I have no idea if it's auto. Pretty sure gold wave means ink, though. And here we go. Candelario Refractor. Nice Eloy rookie. Urias rookie. Kingham. Max Muncy Refractor. Prism of Lugo. Kikuchi. We got a DJ Stewart. Nice socks duel there. We do have an auto. Chris Shaw, rookie refractor for the Giants. Lowers the odds. Chris Shaw for the San Fran. Stephen Kay, that's all you. Nice Shaw. Robbie Cano and Mookie. Kopech, Scherzer, and Cave. Let's see who that gold wave is. It is a non-auto. I don't know why I forgot that there's non-autos. Oh boy, it's a really nice one. Padres, have yourself a break. Urias Gold Wave, San Diego Strikes, again, 28 out of 50. I'd say it looks pretty sharp next to that. That's a nice break for San Diego. Beauty. And two points. Uh, who was it with San Diego again? Stephen K. Tie for first, my friend. Tatis and the Urias. Let's do Series 2. If you guys are asking why this is in here, go look up uh, what Base Tops rookies are selling for all the big boys. It's just stupid. Especially graded. And the shot at ink. A lot of it is garbage base. I understand that. Everybody understands that. But there is pretty damn nice value in each box of these. Let's find some. Now that I got done with my spiel. By popular demand, we finally started putting base tops and rookie P. Honestly, it should increase the value back to you guys. But the downside is we gotta go through all the rookies. Try to spot variations, so that's always fun. So this will be about the speed we go. There's the Tatis. Anybody spots anything, feel free to let me know. Willie Peralta, gold, out of 2019. Tampa Bay Rays, field, a foil. Love the upside down mojo. Nice Eloy. And Stassi. First box, we got Tatis and Eloy, base rookies. Always, Mike. Always. Big fat card in here. Let's fall down. There we go. Future stars, Tyler Tom. For the big names here, big rookies anyways, Benintendi. Nothing in box two, we do have a hit though. Oh, I actually had two right here. Stephen Wright gold and a Taylor Rogers 150th year parallel. Whoever that Lorenzo Kane is. Wright, numbered out of 2019. And the hit, Tony Gwynn. Professional baseball, 150 year commemorative medallion. Tony Gwynn going to the Padres. Is that numbered? It is numbered out of 25. Padres, have yourself a break. Three-point card, Stephen K in the first place. He has top series two to thank. Two out of 25 on the Gwyn. Very nice card. All right, next pack. Look for those rookies. Gold Colin McHugh, again, numbered, 2019. There's our first Vlad. 
Nice base, Vlad, tops, rookie. Jays, Dino. That's all you, man. Landino and Griffey. Yaddy. That one looked a little funky, but no. Trope. And bottom rookies. Nothing still. Stanton and Iglesias. Tatis, Eloy, and Vlad so far in the box. He may be interested in that, yeah. Sounds like it's right up his alley. Josh James and Armstrong and Archer. There's a gold Velazquez. 219. Jeffrey Ramirez. That's out of 67. There's one of the black parallels. This card O's. It's going to be a one point hit for Baltimore. So the O's this break are Murray. Murray, your first points in rookie P, I think. Let's see where it puts you here. Officially into the leaderboard. Rizzo, Ramirez, and Machado. Next pack. Kansas City Royals team card. Is this a variation of any type? Otani gets hot. Just in case anybody is aware. I'll have to double check that one at the end. Got a gold Austin wins and a White Sox foil. A couple nice inserts there. Code on the back of the Otani ended in 3962. Using Ronnie's trick here. And we got a hit. It's an Aaron Judge relic out of 150. Second hit. One, nope, 56 out of 150 on the judge. Nice card. No points on that, though. 3962, so no variation. And we get the upside down again. There we go. Conley, Colin Bird. All right, halfway through a Series 2 box. Got a couple really nice rookies going on the second half yet. No auto yet. <laughs> Yes! All of 2019. Kind of looks like something red in there. It's Kevin Newman rookie. There's the red popping out. Mikey Maddock. That is out of 76. 39 out of 76 for the Detroit Tigers. Mikey Maddock. Nice parallel. I am not sure what that's called. Could be flag, red, who knows? Tigers? Nick Bro. One point for you. Every bit helps, right? Nick, where are you at? Two for you. And the foil was Roman Quinn. Bellinger and Gung. There's the base. Fair price. True one of one. 55 bucks. Hell yeah. Couple nice ballparks there. Roman Quinn. Shaw Sheen is the gold. Tucker Barnhart is the foil. Astudio. Nice rookie in there. Flip the last couple here. Voight and Castro. Three packs left on Series 2. 2018 Ultimate Draft. Damn, we do have an auto there. I 
I don't want to speak too early. That looked like a Logo Man auto. I can't imagine hitting that type of card out of Series 2, but they do exist. Don't get your hopes up, though. It could have just been a crazy-looking patch. Schwarber home run challenge for the Cubs. Nice. Any big rookies? Big names? Nothing yet. All right, we got some ink here. Let's see what the heck it is. Which way am I going? It is a Logo Man of some sort. I'm assuming it's a commemorative and not game use, but holy crap, let's find out. Wow, that really looks amazing. It is commemorative. There is no number on that, but that really looks sharp. And it is actually numbered out of 10, wow. Golden Anniversary MLB Silhouetted Batter Logo Patch from Series 2. The Mariners are Brad W. A very nice hit, my friend. Rookie P407. It's going to score some points. Let's get an exact tally on the points. It was a five-point card, doubled for the ink. And the jersey, it's not a jersey relic, so it doesn't get the extra point. Ten-point card, dude. Or no, four-point card. Sorry, it's numbered out of ten. So eight once it gets doubled. That is beautiful. Numbered out of ten on the back. Awesome card. That's cool. Series 2 debut here. And Brad, let's add you on here. You haven't scored anything yet. Oh, yeah, I did. I got you on there twice now. There we go. Okay. Nothing like bumping into second place with one card. Brad, if you have any interest in trading, Steven's a Mariners fan. Or selling. Boom. Nice card. Two packs left. Haven't spotted a variation yet. There's an Alonzo on the bottom. I'm going to grab that. Base Alonzo. Good money right there, though. Through the middle here. Back-to-back -back 150s. Bregman. We're backwards again. Last studio and mats. Whammy pack there, no good rookies. Or, duh, the Alonzo. You did see a Griffey variation? Which pack was it in? I'm gonna have him check. Well, actually, it's all getting sorted by team anyway, so it'll be there. But I'm still gonna have him check. Rowdy. I'd like to grab the Griffey, though, while we have it out fresh. If you could remember how far back you happen to see it. Zach Granke is the gold, and the foil is the Colorado Rockies. Love flipping cards over. Bueller and Yarborough, and that's it. J.D. Davis on the bottom. <laughs> okay, almost the end of the break, but we got two big boxes left, and then the Leaf. 19 Bowman Hobby up first, followed by a Jumbo, and then Valiant and Trinity to close. That was a single box of tops. Yep. Ten Jumbo Packs. Top Series 2 Jumbo. Griffey with the bats next to him. I'm just going to grab it. So I can make sure that it's not in with the regular base. Couldn't have been too far away, right? Right back to the break, guys. Let me grab that Griffey and verify. found another variation too. Bregman was a variation. The code on the back verifies. Card number 700 on the Bregman. So Stroh's got a nice little variation there, Steve. Let's 
just want to grab that Griffey. It was white and purple. Come on, Griffey! Where you at, man? Well, if it's not in this stack, I'll just find it at the end, I guess. No. Bregman stinking it up? No! I'll leave the other update base right there, that way I can just flip through and find it at the end. Okay, 19 Bowman. Let's get one more half stack done, we'll go through them both. Oh, Urius you're talking about, yeah. I was like, Bregman, I think, is having a pretty damn good season. Yeah, Urias, I haven't tracked much. Nice Bronco first. Nice Bronco Chrome. Nice start for the Rays. Bronco first paper. Bronco Bowman. Chrome. Well, McKay ready for the show. There's going to be one auto in this box. There's an Urias rookie. Freudus. Whitley Marsh and Adele. Ooh, there's the first yawn of the night. We got a whole nother break to go. No, he did not. Vladdy ready for the show. Blue popped out. Will Smith, 150 for LA. Noel V. Marte, first Bowman. Sterling of Urias, Amaya, Quantrill, Mize, and Fabian. Polish off the first half of the Bowman hobby box. Aqua, Spanberger, 125 for the Jays. Victor, Victor. Well, let's try out the other half. Okay, we got a Rangers pipeline here to kick the stack off. Still looking for our auto. There's a Nola 30th. Nice Alonzo Chrome. Danny Jansen and Nick Neidert. And there it is, Terso. Padres keep having themselves a break. 217, 499. Terso or Nelius. Stephen K. That is yours, buddy. So the auto's out. Contreras, Robert, and Boz, and two more small stacks here for the hobby. Right into the jumbo after this. Jimenez, Waters. Looks like an atomic on the way. It is definitely an atomic. Swaggerty on the chrome. It's a Yankee. It's Esteban Floreal of the Yankees. Mm -hmm. 
Duggar, Tucker, and Arenado. Absolutely. Probably the best Padres break in a while. 30th Rizzo, Victor Victor. Actually, that was Victor Mesa. Roy Santana, Kalenic, and Ronnie Mauricio. Here we go, last big box. 19 Bowman Jumbo, three autos to find. Six toe, Diamondbacks Pipeline. Then we got a Jimenez Perez, Rutherford and Pearson. Oh uh, yeah, the Dodgers, absolutely. That is just a monster, of course. Why am I going through paper base here? <laughs> Tatis, first auto is at another Terso. What are the odds? Padres, base and refractor now. Different boxes, too. Two autos left in the 19 Bowman. There will be a ton of points scored in the Valiant and Trinity, just FYI, in case anybody is not aware. A lot of low numbered cards. We got a rookie auto. It looks like Corbin Burns. It's because it's Corbin Burns. I could see the COB. Refractor 499 for the Brew Crew. Stephen K., that's all you. Jeez, I forgot about that, Nate. Yeah. That wasn't a rookie P, though. That's what I was thinking. I was thinking the best rookie P Padres break in a while. But, fair point. <laughs> Burroughs, Whitley. Nice Jordan Alvarez, Sterling. Bannon Johnson and Hernandez. Comic peaking. It is a Vander Franco. This card for you, Mike. O125 out of 150 on the Atomic Franco with the facsimile auto. Purdy. No points, though. Kyle Tucker and Rogers. Bottom chromes are De La Cruz, Siegler, and Mai. Got an Aqua. DL Hall, Aqua, 125. Mauricio, first Bowman. Keston, pipeline for the A. Javier Peters. What do we got? Two autos. We got Burns and Ornelius. So one more siding. Probably going to be a Padre or two in the Leaf stuff. I, I would be surprised if not. Probably a J or two. There's another Franco. Sterling. Very nice. Daniel Johnson, 499 for the Nats. Paper and Chrome. Paper and Chrome. We got gold. Jimenez. Senzel. Cedric Mullins. Rookie of the Year favorites. Is that James? The O's or was that Murray? I can't remember who had him this break. Murray's got him this break. Nice card. 24 out of 50 on the Cedric Mullins. Somebody stuck to the back of Cedric. Brady Singer. Four point card for you, Murray. Up to five points, bro. Nice card, 24 out of 50. Damn flies. All right, Dunning, May, and Abreu. Three packs, we got our autos. 
No, he uh, he did not win Rookie of the Year. I feel like they just needed somebody else for the set. And they're like, yeah, Cedric Mullins. He's got a shot. Yodi Tavares on the bottom of that stack. It's like, spoiler alert, he did not win it. Los Suarez de Plantier, Cardinals Pipeline, Logan Webb and Costello. Diamondbacks, purple, 250, a Duplantier, Joey Bart, and we go to the finale. Joey Bart on the bottom, too, first moment. All right, ladies and gents, good luck, Valiant and Trinity, to close. See a lot of color. The slab, I think, was colored. See a lot of numbers in here, too. There's the empty. Top loaders. First card. Wow, this box is unreal. I just saw three names, all top names in the product, all in this box. Number one, Luis Robert. Rising stock for the Sox. Adam P. Two point card for you, Adam P. This is where things get squirrely. So 87 out of 99, Robert. How about Pete Alonzo right after that? Orange Valiant. Even more points. One out of 35. That is a four-pointer. Four-pointer for the Mets. The Mets were Dean. Dean takes the lead. One out of 35 on the Pete Alonzo. Beautiful card. The centering is actually perfect on that for Valiant. Robert and Alonzo. Now, let's skip over to Trinity. First card out of 25 for the Padres. It's going to be worth seven points. Three for the numbering, double for the ink, extra point for the jersey. Seven points for the Padres. Stephen K. Just like that. 16 for you, buddy. 14 out of 25. Three color patch, too. Up next. Our first non-numbered card out of Leaf, and it's a friggin' Nolan Gorman. Cardinal, Stephen K. Have yourself a break, my friend. Nice card. PC for you, too, if I recall you're a Cardinals fan. Clean Gorman right there. Very clean. Non-scoring again, Osiris Johnson for the Marlins. Beauty. Second round pick, and then... His name with a smiley face, I think. Marlins or Murray. Check out the freaking patch that has a logo man out of 10. Eight point card, extra point for the relic. Nine points, Mike Ciani. Cincinnati Reds, who got a Mike E. Just scored nine points in a rookie P. What the hell is going on? Are you even in the room, Mikey, to witness your points? You could win the tournament tonight. Wow. Make sure I got that right. Four for the number, double for the ink, plus one for the patch. Boom. Nine-point card, bro. Mike Ciani. I wish it was Senzel for you, but I think you'll take it. Second to last patch. Braxton Ashcraft for the Pirates. Chad. Little three-color action, Braxton Ashcraft. Nice card. Back to the Valiant. Back to the points. Oh my god, a fourth big name under this. This box has four of the top, probably six or seven names in the product, value-wise. Caden Grenier is not one of those. 11 out of 25 on the Navy for Baltimore. That's a six-point card for the O's. Murray, up to 11. 11 out of 25. Hi, Rick, he says. 
Nice Grenier. Orioles doing work. So the fourth big name out of this box is Joey Bart. What do we have so far? We have Luis Robert, Pete Alonzo, Joey Bart, and you guys will see the last one shortly. Two-point card for the Giants, Stephen K. 76 out of 99. You're up to 18. Just a piece of fuzz on the top loader there. Nice Joey Bart. Mariners stand up. Brad W. It's a Mets patch, but that goes to the M's. Triple color on the Jared Kalenic. Not Tatis, Brian. Not Tatis. Somebody that I would be quite familiar with, though. If that gives it away. Which it may not. Brad W. Nice card, dude. Seattle comes through at the end with a nice Kalenic. And the last card in... Rookie P407, no points on that clinic. Boba shit! Don't look now, but the kid is out playing Vlad in every aspect of the game. I love them both, just stating facts. Rising stock Navy, 9 5 and a 10. 19 out of 25 on the Boba shit. Good for six points in the tournament. Blue Jays, Dean. We got ourselves a point battle tonight. 18, 16, 11, 9, 8, 6. Everybody in the running here. Good stuff. Going into the last break. All right, Bo Bichette. All right, guys, give me about uh, five minutes to get everything sleeved. I'm going to grab that Griffey SP, too, so we can have that on the recap. And we'll be back with the final break of the evening. Here is the link. Let me see if anything else sold while we we're breaking. A lot more sold. Let me see how much is left. Three, four, nine, ten teams left. Gonna bump it up to 13% too. So it's a late night crew. Get a little extra before we get going here. So 10 to 13 active now. You guys wanna check this out while I'm doing the recap, feel free. It'll be a few minutes while I sleep stuff. Probably be two or three here. And if anybody needs anything graded from this, please let me know. Can set it off on the side. Get it all slabbed up nice and fresh. It sounded really lame. Photos there, chrome ink there, so we get everything numbered. It's a heck of a rookie P. I don't think it's an all time great rookie P, but it may be in the conversation just because a Bellinger was pulled from a single pack. Astronomically low odds. Probably in the 0.0%. Alright, let's so make sure I didn't miss anything that was 99 or lower in this stack. Doesn't look like it. All right, we're gonna find that Griffey uh, short print and then we'll do the recap. You guys are positive it was an SP, right? So I'm not chasing a ghost here. If I don't find it, I'll leave it to my sorter to find it. I'll give it a quick run through on each stack. Not a 
on that stack. Not on that stack. The Vlad rookie was... That looked like his base rookie. You mean just Vlad himself being short printed, or was that an actual short print uh, variation? Because it didn't look like one to me. I've got a couple of those. I thought they were all the same, but I could be wrong. Okay, yeah. Just the card itself is a short print, yes. There was a lot of confusion when the checklist dropped, because I think it shares a number with somebody else in the product, right? Santana. It's not a variation. No Griffey yet. I got two stacks left. Can't seem to hit for you, bro. I don't blame you. Gotta switch it up. Maybe try some cheese out. This Griffey's literally gonna be in the last stack I checked. Does it not want to be found? The Griffey Ghost lives on so far. NNO. Aha! We found it! And it is an SP. You guys are right. So the M's, a little bonus there, Brad W. I'll make sure I include that on the uh, recap. Let me just make sure I have to get the other image variations out of there. There's one other one. There's a Bregman, I believe. Yep, right there. <laughs> I will never doubt you again, Ernie. You have laser focused eyes, bro. Laser focused eyes. Okay, guys, thank you for being patient. Recap for break 407. Just took a little bit longer. I wanted to make sure we got the uh, short prints and variants on. I'm all sneezy. Okay. Uh, the Vlad is an SP. We did hit one. A couple other nice ones, too, out of the Series 2. We had a Bregman variant and a Griffey variant, or variation, whichever way you want to say it. The scoring cards that were not autographed. Bueller, 99 for LA. Straw, what was that? 60? 99 for Houston. Beautiful Urias Gold rookie. Padres, Ramirez, that was black out of 67. Mikey Maddock was red out of 76 flag parallel, I'm assuming. And this Franco didn't score any points, but it's a beautiful card, Atomic out of 150. There was also a Franco first paper and a Franco first prune for the Rays. Two relic kits, both out of Series 1. Tony Gwynn, professional commemorative medallion that was out of 25 for the Padres, two out of 25. And an Aaron Judge jersey out of 150 for the Yankees. A couple buttes. Our Leaf Autos. Man, we had a heck of a box of Valiant. We'll get to it shortly here. First one was Joey Bart. Actually, it looks like I have them all on the top. We had a Joey Bart, 99 for the Giants. Grenier, 25 for the O's. Gorman, clear for the Cardinals. Alonzo, 35 for the Mets. Robert, uh, 99 for the White Sox. Heck of a box, and we still had the slab there, too. Kalenic goes out to the M's, even though it's a Mets patch. Ashcraft for the Pirates. Amazing Logo Man patch here. Siani for the Reds. 
points for Mikey. Osiris Johnson for the Marlins. Rosario for the Padres. And the other big name out of the Valiant Box. Literally four of the best names you could pull. Bo Bichette as well. Rising Stock Navy out of 25. So sharp. And 10 on the auto too. That was the Valiant and the Trinity. And here's all our Chrome. We had a Robles. Fall League got a 150. The Nationals. Gorgeous Tatis. Rated Rookie Blue for the Padres out of 35. The Belly. This came out of the lone 15 Chrome Jumbo Pack in here. Unbelievable odds. Awesome when it happens. Baralio. That's headed off to the Grading Gods. Bo Burrows for Detroit. Anderson for the Braves. Conine for the Jays. Jansen for the Jays. Lakens for the Sox. McGuire for the Jays. Shaw for the Giants. Ornelius doubled up. Not even in the same box. One was from Hobby, one was from Jumbo, Refractor and Base. Burns for the Brew Crew, a gold Cedric Mullins out of 50. And how about this wacky hit? Mitch Hanniger out of 10. Commemorative Golden Anniversary Silhouette Autographed Patch. Pretty sweet, and that's out of 10. I went to the M, 6 out of 10. And that's it. Break 407 in the books. Thanks, everybody. We got 408 to end the show tonight. Get that video saved and uploaded shortly. And the Bellinger for Brody. I'll never doubt Ernie again on short prints. Okay, guys, video saved.